So, JL, uh, what could be probably is your last season here, you know, your last fall camp. How are you approaching this season? I uh, was just approaching it with gratitude and urgency. Uh, time's ticking, you know. Season's coming real fast, so I'm just trying to approach every day with a sense of gratitude and urgency for the team. So that way we know we came to really accomplish during the season. So that's how I'm approaching the game every day. You've seen and heard all the hype, but for you personally, what are your goals? Where do you think you can get better on the field this year? Uh, I don't really – tune into the hype like I just retweet those things just because it's just something that you do you know uh I don't really care about the hype too much I'm not really having many personal goals as if I need to get this many tackles or this many interceptions I don't really care for that my goal is to win a championship honestly that's my whole mindset right now I don't care about me personally I'm trying to do everything for the team and make sure we're in the best position to go get us a ring so I came here one to leave before I only have one right now so I got to get one more how is the secondary different with Ty at nickel uh, it's just a different mix-up for us, you know. Uh, it helps us out in the run game and different aspects of the game because Tariq's a great player. Uh, we also have guys who can step in and also do things in that position also. So we can mix around everybody in our defensive backfield, which is very nice. Everyone knows everything. So it's a nice little switch-up for us to see how things work. Shea Oladipo and Rodney Robinson, um, what do both of them bring? Uh, I say energy, man. Both of those dudes are young dudes technically, but they bring a sense of energy and I say intelligence to the game where they seem like they're older. Especially with us uh, older guys, me and T. Jones, we got to help them out and try and bring them along and show them things that we learned throughout our years. So those guys are energetic, passion, love for the game, everything about the football player that you want those guys have. To me, job description between the nickel and the boundary safety and the free safety, what makes the three positions different and what makes them the same? Uh, they're, I mean, they're all just have, they have different, uh, I say, attributes and things that are required. That's really it. Just not really... There's not really a big difference. Like I said, all of us are interchangeable. So we can all go, I can go play field safety right now and be perfectly fine. So our defense is very nice that way. And it's not really a big difference, but it's just a little things like that, different attributes and skill sets that take. What's the biggest thing with nickel that would be different? Matches? Nickel is just closer to the line of scrimmage. That's it. Uh, our safeties are usually a little bit deeper. So just, nickel, just different alignments and such like that. That's the difference between the nickel and the boundaries.